if you look at the work that we uh, helped with then HSX, uh, going back again to the start of the year, it's about response to the, the pandemic. There were some great initiatives. The, if we look at the level of innovative companies operating across the UK who came forward as part of the Tech Force 19 initiative uh, and offered help, help and assistance, uh, there were some really great um, examples of the use of technology in terms of things like remote care, about taking out the human element of ensuring that the vulnerable and isolated within the communities could be looked after. <clears throat> and if, if we look at you know, the challenge that was facing us, the original one and a half million people who needs to shield, which actually became about 2.1 million people, um, I mean, that is a very large cohort who can't have people turning up at their door, you know, for their 15 or 30 minute, you know, care plan slot. So we had to find a way of meshing together the various technologies and capabilities out there to give us three things. One of which is the ability to call in to people. So outbound contacts into the most at risk cohort, as opposed to the wholly inbound local government contact centre approach that's in there using video and other types of technology to monitor the people within their homes to ensure that if absolutely required, we can schedule an attended visit you know, if there is a challenge. Or even in many cases, basically dial them in for a remote, a remote consultation with um, primary care uh, from an NHS perspective. And then the final piece is, is really is how do we ensure that the right type of care is available in the right place at the right time and learning lessons around things like dynamic dispatch from the private sector and how we can apply that to the care providers themselves. From a pure financial perspective, if we're able to displace just 50% of the attended care that you know, some of this at-risk cohort face, the local authority could look at something around um, £10 million of saving each year. So there are big numbers associated with doing things with technology.